Good morning. Today we're going to be doing a day in the life of an American University student. So I just woke up at 7.30 a.m. And yeah, I'm going to get ready and then I'll get back. So see y'all. <music> Alright, so I just finished getting ready. Um, kind of dressed up because on Mondays, Wednesdays, and uh, Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays I have an uh, internship online, so I have to dress up. Um, but yeah, so I'm about to go to my classes right now. I have two today. I have my first one is at 8 a.m. It's Anthropology of Life in the U.S. And then my second one is at 9:45 and it's American Constitution. So yeah, I'll see you guys. Okay, so this is first hall. This is where my first class is. And yeah, I don't want to show too much because I want to do a campus tour. So yeah, but anyways, see y'all after class. Okay, so I just got out of class. Now I gotta go to my next one. So um, yeah, my next one is American Constitution with Professor Boyle. Um, he is the best professor ever. So if you ever are in SPA, um, either political science or JLC, make sure to take his class. All right, this is where my next class is, School of Public Affairs at Kerwin Hall. And here, this is my school. This is where I have my major. I wear this shirt on purpose um, to fit the situation. All right, so I just got out of class. It actually feels really nice. Um, but anyways, yeah, I love Professor Boyle. He's the best professor. So if you ever want to take him and you come to AU, take Professor Boyle. He's so funny, so easy. And yeah, so I'm going to go eat now and probably meet up with a friend. Um, yeah. Hey vlog, it is Isabel. We are here in TDR with Alisa Edwin. Bye guys. Okay, so I ate a bagel, but I also got a slice of pizza and brownies because I love eating healthy. Bro, it feels so nice today. It's like weird because it's been kind of cold. But anyways, now I ate and like, well, I finished eating in like 15 minutes because I finished class at 11 and then at 11.30 I have to go to work study. So yeah, I'm about to go to my federal work study job. I work at SIS, the School of International Service. And it's pretty easy. I just sit there and do my homework and get paid for that. So I really like it. Um, this is the building right here. So yeah. Okay, so now it's time for my internship. It's virtual. I do this on three times a week. Um, today I do it from one to 4 p.m. It is virtual. So yeah, and I'm currently interning for APAPA. It stands for Asian Pacific Islander American Public Affairs. And basically we just advocate for minority representation and help individuals register to vote and then encourage them to vote so then we can help with the representation here in America. So yeah. Sometimes for this internship, we work on like social media posts for the Instagram page and like Twitter and LinkedIn and Facebook and all that. And I just wanted to show you guys on the one that I worked on for today. Well, one of the ones that I worked on for today because I made like a few, but um, yeah. Basically, we were um, highlighting uh, an American Olympic who is from an API community and um, highlighting them to quote them on the post. So I did Nathan Chan, Nathan Chan, I don't know how to pronounce the name, sorry if I mispronounce it. But basically he was a first time gold medalist winner for um, this year. And yeah, that's what I did. Bro, it honestly feels so nice today. Like, ah, uh, I honestly think like I get seasonal depression <laughs> because this weather is too nice and it like just uplifts your mood, I don't know. It feels so good, but anyways, um, I just got out of SIS because that's where I did my internship today. Um, right now, I'm going back to my room because I have to join my professor's office hours, and then after that, I'm just gonna take a nap. And yeah, so I will see you guys 
after my nap and yeah i think that's what i'm gonna do right now so see y'all okay so i just woke up it's currently six o'clock um i had a pretty good nap <laughs> um now i'm going to katzen across campus to go practice my saxophone because i am in symphonic band and i take private music lessons here um so i have to practice my saxophone i'll probably do that for an hour and i'll show you guys what it looks like when i get there okay so this is katzen art center this is where they have a lot of performing arts and um i believe the arts and science i don't know all right i'm here i play the saxophone um i also play other few instruments but here i only play saxophone um this is what uh practice room looks like <sighs> there's a few of them um you don't have to reserve them or anything but yeah each one has a piano like chairs mirrors and stands and stuff to clean it so yeah all right so now i came to eat this is my dinner um i just came to the dining hall tdr like i did earlier um i got pasta and yeah all right so now i'm at the library because i had to do homework i can't oh shoot <laughs> i came with jeremiah yeah um and i'm working on a research paper so yeah see you guys later uh Okay, so it's currently 10.30 p.m. Um, I went to the library for like an hour and a half, almost two hours-ish, kind of. Um, but yeah, now I'm gonna work out. I came to the gym and I don't really know what day I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna do like backs, my back. <laughs> I can't speak, but um, yeah. All right, it is now 12 a.m. And it's been a long day. Um, on an ideal day, this is everything I would do. Sometimes I skip practicing my saxophone, even though I shouldn't. Sometimes I skip going to the gym, even though I shouldn't. But today, um, I did everything that I wanted to. Um, I've had some days like this. They are very tiring in the end of the week. I'm exhausted. Tomorrow's finally Friday, so I'm happy about that. And I only have one class until 12.55, so I can sleep in a little bit. Um, But, yeah, so I'm about to shower, and then I'll probably just lay in bed and watch TikTok or YouTube or Netflix until I end up falling asleep. And then wake up and do it all over again tomorrow. So, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you guys have any ideas for any further videos that I can make about AU, please comment down below because I would love to make them and help you guys get to know AU and make your decisions for college. So yeah, thank you. Bye.